attorneys general for 16 states are asking the Securities and Exchange Commission to investigate Chinese company Xi'an's claims that it does not use forced labor. News Nation's Emily Finn takes a closer look. We can't always know what's behind what we're buying. Arkansas Attorney General Tim Griffin is one of 16 Republican Attorney Generals across the U.S. urging the SEC to investigate Xi'an, a Chinese-based fast fashion company accused of forced labor practices. They sent a letter to the SEC requesting independent audits of Xi'an's labor standards. The brand sells cheap products in 150 countries across the world and manufactures most items in China. But as Xi'an is reportedly working with investment banks on a potential initial public audit, offering in the U.S., officials are putting pressure on the brand to ensure they comply with U.S. labor standards. Griffin says there have already been investigations into the company's alleged abuses. There are credible alleg allegations as a result of what they found that uh, Sheehan is using forced labor to support uh, this, um, this retail, this growth and this retail giant. And now they want to do business, benefit from uh, the United States. Despite concerns about labor abuses, Xi'an has grown rapidly in the U.S., operating a growing warehouse in Indiana that opened last year. News Nation reached out to Xi'an for a statement, with a spokesperson telling us the company's policy is to comply with the trade laws of the countries in which we operate. We have zero tolerance for forced labor, adding, we will continue to engage with U.S. federal and state officials to answer their questions. But Griffin isn't convinced. Well, we wouldn't take any company's word that said that, much less uh, a Chinese company such as this. All we're asking is that the SEC verify with, it, with an independent uh, investigation, independent review, to make certain that our laws are being followed. If some